Shit. Okay, sorry about that. My glasses are very dirty, so I had to clean them off here real quick. And then we can play some Sly 2. Welcome to the stream, High Volt Games. This is the first High Volt Games, not the second one. Thank you for coming to the stream. I gotta remember to make a list here too. Uh oh. Why did that just happen? I think I just goofed some. <laughs> I just fucked this up. What happened? There we go. That was weird. This capture card's really finicky, so I I apologize. It is hanging by a thread. Where was I going to go oh, here? There we go. Okay, pulling back this up. Hello, True Terror. Welcome to the stream. I'm sorry that I didn't just see you just now. Let me I just want to get everybody's names so I can properly thank people who come here. Okay. Alright, pull up the trophy list too. And everybody can hear the game okay? Do you need me to turn it up or anything? Just uh, let me know if I do. And then we'll go from... We'll go from there. So yes, let's play some Sly 2. Now, if you didn't watch the Sly 1 playthrough, that's fine. Because it is on the profile. You can find it. I have a playlist for the whole Sly Cooper collection. I'm hoping it'll be the whole Sly Cooper collection. But yeah, I really enjoyed playing the first one. There were some really annoying things in it, but overall, really great game. And a really easy platinum, so if you care about getting platinum trophies, uh, it doesn't take long. Hopefully work hasn't been too crazy for you. Let's see. Oh. This is Peking Duck. I hear you, Blizzard. No, Sly, I'm the wizard, and you're Sinting Duck. I read you loud and clear, Lizard. No, I, I'm... <laughs> forget it, you're not taking this. Uh, you can't move their heads anymore. Look, Bentley, I know this is your first time out in the field, but you've got to loosen up. If we're going to get to those clockwork parts, I need you on your toes. So in plain talk, what's your status? Well, I've established myself in the basement. And I'm pretty sure I can rewire the service elevator if you can I gotta remember how to play this game too. Station. Hang tough, pal. It might take some time, but I'll figure out a way to get up there. Alright. I am streaming the game through the PS3 streaming thing. So if it gets a little funky, blame that. Hopefully we don't run into any issues where it'll just close out the game. I have learned from other games that I played that uh, you would have to constantly make sure that you're hitting buttons. Because if not, it will, uh, it will close out on you. Which sucks when you're trying to... Uh, 
just do like normal things. Like, okay, I was trying to, I was trying to get a million bolts and ratchet and clank, and you have to kind of finagle the game a little bit. You have to do like a speed run clip through one of the parts, which sucked ass. Kind of fun to learn how to do, but at the same time, it's like, man, I really wish I didn't have to do this, but you'd have to play through the game like a million times to get a million bolts. And... Yeah, I had to have it to where I had rubber bands on the sticks and just have it... Um, just... <laughs> you just had to run around in circles and sh just, like, suck up the, the bolts... It was really annoying, but I finally got it, and then I, I was so happy. And I also realized, like, eh, I probably should have done something better with my time, but eh. But yeah, we're going to do some Sly 2. I'm hoping that I'll get all the Platinums, though, for, uh, for this series, though. I feel like any game that I grew up playing, I should get the Platinum for. With some caveats there, because some of them uh, are unattainable, so I'm not gonna bother with that. Okay, okay. Let me at that security computer. Okay, I think I fucked up the controls. Cause I know that last time, like the inverted stuff was the right thing to have, and this time it's not. And the PS2 times were were goofy with with the camera controls. Yeah, that's not gonna <laughs> that's not gonna raise any alarms, right? Hurry the fuck up, Bentley! God damn! Thank you. Thanks, pal. For your first time out, you did pretty well. Oh, this operation is far from complete. Now that the lasers and spotlights are offline, Murray should be moving into position for your rendezvous. I'll stay here and provide computer support while you go on ahead. Yeah, I think now you can actually uh, play as some of the other people in the game, which hopefully is fun. Because, man, those missions where you had a... Uh, I can't remember what the hippo guy's name was. Murray. When you had to guide Murray through those turret levels. Absolutely awful. Why do I... I keep getting turned around on the camera controls for some reason, I don't know why. I just want to make sure I'm not missing any collectibles or anything, too. I don't... Alright. Ooh. Just take the long way around. If memory serves, you need to jump and hit the circle button to run along ropes. Of course. Jumping and hit the circle button is what I'm good at. See, yeah, and they've got a lot more stuff going on in the background now, too. I can't believe this is a PS2 game. Realism, man, it's not worth it. Art style, much better. Oh, I have a health bar now, too. I don't just die in one hit. That's amazing. 
Ah, that was the biggest pain in the ass. There he is. Murray. Greetings, citizen. I hope you weren't harmed by my meteoropic entrance. No, Murray, I, I kept at a safe distance. Good, good. The Thunderflop knows neither friend nor foe, only destruction. Yeah, could you maybe channel some of that raw energy into the security gate? Of course. It is nothing before the Murray. <laughs> If anybody is going to come around for uh, the stream, I do have to say I did get Swap Force. I do have the new, uh, another Skylander game that I am going to play. I just don't have the correct portal. I, I remember even asking too, I was like, do I need a different portal for this? No, this should be good. It's not. I tried it. It hurt to see, but yeah. Shall bend it like the truth. Solid work, Murray. You're really in the zone. My hulking frame is too much for that puny rope. You go ahead and unlock the doors from the inside. I'll be waiting in the hallway to help you carry out the clockwork parts. I'm just glad that he actually does something in the game now instead of just driving. Be interesting to see where the other uh, characters are. The clockwork part should be here. This is all wrong. We need to pull the plug on this operation right now. Freeze, Cooper. Inspector Fox, as beautiful and unpredictable as ever. Whereas you crooks are so predictable, you always return to the scene of the crime. Crime? I haven't stolen anything yet. Oh, really? I think they changed the voice actress for this. Parts. You've got the motive. Someone already stole the parts? Don't play dumb with me. It might not have been him, Carmelita. The method of entry and guard Who is she? all point to this being a claw gang job. The claw gang? Constable Neela, I allowed you to sit in on this stakeout as a favor to the Contessa. I really don't Yeah, they definitely changed the help. voice actress for this one. You might. Look at the facts. Facts? Sly Cooper is right here. I caught him red-handed. I'm just saying that there are other criminals in the world other than... Sly Cooper! After him! Hey, come back here, Ringtail! <laughs> Hell no. See you. Oh, Wait up, Sly! Shake a leg, Murray. It's time to go. Freeze! This okay, I thought... Part of the yeah, well, <laughs> this is where things get fun. You can't run forever! Yes, I can. Hold still. Oh, I should have. getting a little hot. You guys go warm up the van. I'll keep Carmelita busy. You're all going to jail. Pick me up at the rendezvous. I ain't going anywhere. I got two more games to go through. Oh shit. That was a bad time to be on. Freeze! Stop, thief! You can't stop me. Hold still! Am I just going? Okay, I was. Worried I was just going back and forth. You can't run I can and I did. You, I'm out. Oh my god. Carmelita's just as angry as ever. She's really quite lovely when she's angry. And that constable Neela. Was a reference to the claw gang just a slip of the tongue, or an intentional clue? That Either chick is way, definitely a villain. Lead on the missing clockwork parts. Clockwork. He was consumed with jealousy for the Cooper clan's thieving reputation. 
Is it inappropriate to refer to him as a monster? No, not at all. What kind of person stays alive for hundreds of years with the express intention of wiping out a rival's family line? Imagine the hatred fueling that first decision to replace his mortal body with soulless machinery. Ultimately, it did the trick. Clockwork lived on. He caught up with my parents, and I wound up in an orphanage. It's there that I met my pals, Bentley, the brains of our outfit, and Murray, the brawn. They turned out to be all the family I needed. Two years ago, I thought I'd finished it. How naive to think I could so easily put an end to that kind of hatred. And now he's back. In pieces, sure, but the threat is real. Does the clock game even... I was about to say, I think it turned, but yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know what's in my future, but I won't let it be a repeat of my past. I'll fight him again. Hopefully this time the boss battle's not fucking horrible. At least this game saves, unlike Dead Rising. Oh, we don't get to be in the the car anymore. I had to call in a few favors to get the goods on the Claw Gang's local operator, Dimitri, a sort of underworld celebrity, equally at home in high-class art circles and shady back alley crimes. Who doesn't like some back alley he was once crimes? A passionate young art student who worked hard to develop his own visionary style. Unfortunately, the art world wasn't quite ready for his kinetic aesthetic. So he gave them what they wanted and started forging old masterpieces. His way of punishing those with bad taste. Dimitri now runs a nightclub on the west side. The thumping music, colorful light shows, and a hint of danger lure in chic young patrons from far and wide. And it's here, hidden somewhere, where we'll find the clockwork tail feathers. What Dimitri plans to do with a clockwork part is beyond me. But those plans end tonight. First one and this one I'm like absolutely no idea. Ooh, we have our own little hideout now. Don't want to play a sly. So we can buy gadgets. Yeah, apparently I need to buy absolutely everything. Play a slide. I tell you, Bentley, it's gonna be a real pleasure robbing this nightclub. I share in your enthusiasm, but before we hit the inside, we'll need to do a little reconnaissance work. What do you have in mind? I've installed this special antenna on the safe house to help with our first job, hacking into Dimitri's satellite array. The coordinates for the job start beacon have been uploaded to your Venacuca. Make your way to this position, and I'll give you a full briefing on our objective. I'm on my way. Alright, hopefully I don't miss any uh, collectibles, because I feel like in the other one I was missing them. Analog stick to move the camera and look around a little bit. Remember, 
Why couldn't I jump from... Okay. Alright, we're gonna find all these bottles first before we do anything. If you see any that I don't see, please let me know because uh, yeah, I don't want to have to go through and find them all again. Oh shit! This keeps tripping me up for some reason. And then I feel like I'm gonna change it again and it's gonna be, it's gonna feel, no, like that feels right. I think at one point for PS2 games, they made it to where like things were inverted. Okay, that's not what I meant to do. I meant to pick his pocket. The levels are a little more open. I feel like for the first game, it was just a straight line for most of those levels. I did see a bottle down here. Let's grab that. I wish I still had the 3D glasses for the third game, because in the third game you could do, like, it's like red-blue kind of 3D, but still it was weird and interesting. die in one hit anymore. Oh god. Die. Cool. Hey, it's super cool guy. <laughs> Hello Aiden. Welcome to the stream. Thank you for dabbing in on here. Even though it's not a dab, it looks like a dab, so we're gonna we're gonna roll with it. Appreciate you coming to the stream again. Just want to let you know that uh, eventually we will there will be another uh, Skylanders stream, but uh, I don't have a portal for it. I mean, a dab does look like an elbow cough, so I, I guess that that makes sense. Where did he come from? Yeah! Oh, now you can hide under tables. That's fun. I say that, and I'm not even going to stealth around at all. I don't think I ever used any stealth in the first game. I don't know if it was really... You were told to really do stealth at all? I don't know. <laughs> Thank you, Aiden. I'm glad you think I'm a cool person. I feel pretty shitty about myself most of the time, so that... That is nice to hear. Uh oh. Oh, it's so nice that you don't die from one... One hit from that. What is this?
How am I supposed to do that? To start, you'll need to get to the top of that tower. Then reposition the satellite dish to point at my safe house antenna. And if you want to climb on stuff, jump and hit the circle button to grab hold. Oh, he's got to jump hit the circle button. Right. Jump and press the circle button to climb pipes. I'm on it. I feel like they went with a more... Yeah, just open world environment vibe. Oh god, he saw me. Oh god, they're throwing shit at me now. I thought at some point that I should play uh, the Metal Gear Solid games, but then I was like, I, I, I'm so bad at stealth games, I just feel like I'd be embarrassing myself playing it. Oh, no. Oh, oh, there we go. Oh, there's one of the bottles. I saw that there's a another bottle. But yeah, these hint bottles are the, the main collectibles in these games. So yeah, as I said before, if you see them and I don't, by all means let me know. I can't believe it was two weeks ago that I played that game. It blows my mind. Uh, one of the other people that watched the stream uh, it's, uh, well, he did go by Epic Zombie Killer. I can't remember what his name is now. Uh, he's been watching since I played Spyro Reignited Trilogy. And that was six or seven months ago. And he's been pretty consistently watching my streams now. And, yeah, it's just like... It, <laughs> It's to the point where he apologizes if he doesn't come to a stream. I'm like, you don't have to apologize for anything. It's not a big deal. It's cool that you even come around at all. Ooh, I got another trophy. Okay. Almost got all the bottles. I wonder where the rest of them are. I hope you, there's actually like a... I don't think there is like a map. Oh, I thought that was a fart bomb. I would like to see like an open world game that looked like this. Such a fun design. You know, I don't feel like we need to have ultra realistic graphics or anything. Just games just need to be fun. That's it. circle. Oh, there's the objective. I don't see... see anything here. I guess I can just go to the objective now. Well, you have been pretty consistent, Aiden, so... Yeah, you are... you are good. I'm hoping that when I'm done with, uh playing the Skylander games that people will still be sticking around and checking out what I play. I'm not really sure what to, to move on to next. I thought about playing some more horror games, but I don't know which ones to play.
You've already named it the the dab app, the dab emoji. So you're, yeah. We we don't need official licensing. Got him. And there's another bottle. If anything. You can go back and watch those Skylander streams over and over. And then when, if there's ever a new game, you come back and go, oh yeah, this guy. If I'm still streaming. I've almost been doing it for a year now. It's just a way for me to go, like, I really need to do something with my time. I feel like a lot of times I was just sitting on the couch doing nothing. Like, I should try to do something. And I like doing creative stuff. I know this isn't really the most creative thing, but hoping that as time goes on I can explore other avenues and stuff too. I see this giant bug on my wall too and I really want to get it. So I might get up in a second to go throw them outside. It's just like a little... I don't know what kind of bug it is to be honest, but it's not anything crazy. Ah, random guy is here. Oh yeah, let me... <laughs> Cause I, just so that I don't forget all the people that come in here. Got. Oh, where'd he go? Random guy. I'm making a list. You could replace Skylanders once you beat all the games. I've seen lots of Skylanders you YouTube played over and over. Isn't it? I don't know if it's necessarily going to be what. I'm going to replay over and over. I I, I, my plan was to get the platinum trophies and then be, be done, dip out, go on to another series. I might play something more chill. My friends were talking about playing something like uh, Stardew Valley or something, or... Or I could go I really need to go back to play uh, Resident Evil 4 Remake. I was playing that for a little bit. I also thought about playing Haunting Ground or Rule of Rose. I don't know how that's going to go. I own Rule of Rose and I'm like, ah. <laughs> Skylanders is a pretty chill game. Uh, if you're playing it on the easier difficulties, it's a... It is a very chill, easy game. Expert wasn't too bad, but I also have like 40 Skylanders. I I told a friend of mine, because so I didn't stream yesterday because I was hanging out with a friend. And I told them that I've been playing these games. And they're like, how many figures do you think I have? And they just looked at me and go, knowing you, you probably have like 50 of them. And I'm like, first off, fuck you. Second off, you're right. <laughs> I have so many of them. I don't I don't know what to do with them. I think what's going to happen is, if I have all the games, and if somebody is just like, I really want to play those games, I'm like, you can have all of my stuff. Just, just take them. Please. I beg you. If I ever get popular enough to go to a convention thing, I'm just going to... Every person that comes and sees me at my booth, I'll give them one Skylander. Here you go. I'm like, why? Why? I don't want this. Like, I don't know what to do with it either. Uh, there was a game store that I went to because I was trying to see if I could find the portal because I was like, maybe I could play Swap Force. And 
the owner was like, dude, I was throwing those things away. Nobody wants them anymore. I'm like, yeah, of course, when I'm trying to get them, they're worthless. He's like, but I still got the figures. I'm like, yeah, that's great. I don't need them. I have plenty. Way too many. Yeah, some band. Did I go over here already? Oh, there's one. Gotta get the hawk like vision going. 26 I mean, that bug is really crawling up the wall. My place isn't gross or anything, it's just that I live on the first floor and that's where all the bugs like to come in through. I had a squirrel break into my apartment. That was really fun. Just... I heard something just like scratching at like my my floors or something. I'm like, what is that? And I walk outside uh, of my the room that I'm currently in and there it was just on the floor and then went straight out the window. Pissed all over my floor too. I'm like, really? Really? Why? in the dabber and the banner <laughs> yeah I mean you know we I feel like we try to talk about anything really I'm always down to talk about most things it depends I don't want to get people's feathers ruffled too much I might have to show this bug that's on here. I did it! Job completed! Water is wet. It very much is. All in a night's work. So, where do we go from here? Your next job is to break into the nightclub and take some reconnaissance Okay, Ooh. I'll head off for the cellar. Aiden's a little bit of everything. I'm missing four of the bottles, though. Hmm. Hold on. Let me... <laughs> let me go throw this bug outside. you guys can see what kind of bug it is but these guys love getting into my apartment I think you can see it look at this guy they're not gross or anything they don't like yeah they're not like termites or anything like that they're just they're just little dudes they don't bite or anything they do nothing Thank you for dabbing in the stream. Make sure that you guys like the stream as well. And thank you to those who have already. I'm still waiting on getting to 100. I feel like... It'll probably be a while. I feel like by June, 
I feel like by June, though, I can definitely get to 100. I just gotta find that. I gotta... I really gotta make YouTube shorts. I feel like that's gonna be the bread and butter. Thank you for the like. Do not leave, Aiden. I'll feel sad if you leave. You have to stay. Oh, there's the, the objective. Well, thank you for coming to the stream then, Aiden. Don't be sad. Things are gonna work out. see any other bottles. Damn it, I'm gonna need to... Uh, I should be playing with a... Oops. <laughs> I think it's kind of like back and forth on it. I feel like if anything, it doesn't hurt to do it. Good to see you, little I just need to make a good YouTube short, not like a... Uh, <laughs> the ones that I have been making where I'm like, ah, I'll just get, get this little snippet from uh, one of my streams. Like, I need it to be actually edited and stuff. Maybe do like a stream highlight video or something. That's a lot of stuff to watch through, though. Oh, Murray actually does something now. Cool. <laughs> we gotta sneak through this place. He just fights everybody. Hold on, Sly. Let me lower those bars for you. There you go. To get over this thing, you'll have to double jump. Hit the X button to jump. Then, while in the air, press it again to get some extra air time. <laughs> That's how I am, honestly, in most stealth games. I just... Thanks for the help. I just attack everything. I like, code needs stealth when you can just attack. Unless, uh, the ones I really hate, though, are the... If you... If you get caught, the entire mission is over. Stuff like Splinter Cell, where it's like, dude, this is... This is just ridiculous. Exactly. Can't say there's a crime if no one's around. They really want to incentivize you beating the shit out of the environment now too. Since you can buy upgrades and stuff for your people. Well, I guess uh, I could have used some stealth here, but eh. Coins, though. I think you need to upgrade everything in the game. I think you need to have 15,000 coins. Which, honestly, that doesn't seem that bad. I think I should be okay. Exactly. Crime are for people who get caught. I already know how to crawl under this table. Oh wait, hold up, there's bottles. Man, you get so many coins from the bottles. You gotta break all of them. Okay, well I didn't do anything. There's a pig guy. Wait, there was? Oh, oh, no. Those aren't the collectibles. Those are just to... Uh, those are just to get coins. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, 
Well, that... <laughs> I guess that's one way of doing it. I did not mean to just uppercut him like a million times, but... Hey, if that means he doesn't alert the guards, then I'm, I'm fine with that. When one plan fails, you always got to rely on another one. <laughs> this is actually, that's pr a pretty good strat against those guys. Just uppercut them a bunch and then you're good. Sneaking in, baby. If you actually try to sneak into one of these things, though, it's so loud, it's impossible. You're right, I will. <laughs> He's telling me how to do all this stuff. I'm like, Bentley, I'm, I'm already way ahead of you here. Like, I, I got this. I'm Sly fucking Cooper, alright? I I know how to do this. If I wrote the book on this, then cut to me dying to one of them. Oh, I can buy smoke bombs. He he talks in your ear, I think. I don't think it's like a I I don't think it uh He's just not widely announcing himself. I hope not, at least. That'd be kind of silly. Uh-oh. Oh, uh, shit. Yeah! Easy peasy lemon squeezy, baby. Let's go. Watch this game just be extremely easy. And once again, I'll die to the boss fight a million times. If you get in a fight with those rats, the sneak attack won't work. It's purely a stealth move. Wait, he saw me though. Uh -oh. oh god. The triangle. It's not triangling as much. There we go. Ta da! I mean, this game is kind of meant for kids, so I would hope that me, uh,. Me failing the stealth things wouldn't be too much of a punishment. Yeah, I'm hoping that I'll, I'll platinum all of the, the games. It has like a 2 out of 10 difficulty of platinuming it, so it really shouldn't be that bad. I'll just have to look up some guides on where damn hint bottles are because yeah the there's the regular like alcohol bottle stuff that you can break that those will get you coins and stuff which are needed but yeah <laughs> exactly it's like farting you know it's like yeah i could do a little squeaker but it's better to just let it rip just beyblade them I remember going to a, uh, like a musical thing with my now ex, but we went and I my stomach was hurting so bad. I'm like, oh, I need a fart so bad. Like maybe, maybe she won't notice that I'm gonna fart. It'll be fine. And we were with some friends too, and I was like, I'm just gonna do it. I'm just gonna just like a little. A little fart should be good. 
and it was quiet. It didn't happen. Like, you couldn't hear anything, but it smelled... It smelled so bad, I was worried that it was going to alert everybody. Like, wait a minute. This is... This is a... Ugh. I felt like my eyeballs were sweating because it was so putrid smelling, and my... I'm like, oh, my ex hasn't... I don't think they've noticed, so I think I should be good. And then I just slowly see her moving her head towards me and goes, Did you just fucking fart? And I'm like, yeah. <laughs> like, oh. Hello, Ca It's... We know who you are, Cassio F Queso fan. We know. Oh, we get Dimitri. Onions, Arkean, welcome. And cast Queso fan. I keep saying it wrong. <laughs> Aiden, how many of these damn accounts do you have? <laughs> the fuck I do. Is in bedrock now? I've never seen Hermit Craft. Hermit Craft? It's like a D and D thing, right? I did it. Okay, so fan, you better subscribe. Okay, and then our cue. photos are a grim reminder of Oh, it's a Minecraft server. No, there's like a Spotlights, There's like a patrols, thing called Hermitcraft, right? Some of it all renders a direct assault impossible. To solve this puzzle, I'm going to need Oh, what, it, what am I thinking of? First, Harmon? Maybe it's Harmon. Harmon Quest is what I'm thinking of. Place, Oh, yeah. Second, if you see the boss, There's an SMP. Him. What does that mean? We might learn something from studying his movements. Once we've got a proper understanding of the yeah, they were doing a lot of. Uh, that's actually a plot point in one of the Sonic games. Yeah, if you go online and look up uh, Sonic Sonic Inflation, you'll see that there is a lot of. Uh, there's a lot of deep lore with inflation with Sonic. I don't really play Minecraft. I've had some friends that like it, but I'm like, eh, it just doesn't do anything for me. Let's get these smoke bombs. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Only the planet didn't you know work the right around you. Yeah. Bug Dimitri's office. Uh, that's probably where I need to go where it said that. Nothing says stealthy like me just beating the shit out of every pot that I see. Office. Where are the other bottles? Follow Dimitri. Came back to inflation talk. <laughs> I don't know what you mean. We're just talking about uh, economics. I hope no one actually looked that up. Or I hope they did. Screw it. Spinning multipliers? Oh, 
coast is clear for what? Of that I'm uncertain. Ring the bell and follow him without being seen. Then maybe oh god, it's like an Assassin's Creed mission. Dimitri. Hope he doesn't see me. Did he like turn around or something? I'm surprised he doesn't notice my my van. Oh, he does turn around. This is not Crash Bandicoot. This is Sly Cooper. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. But yeah, if you like games like Crash Bandicoot and stuff, I feel like Sly Cooper is a pretty solid one. Where's this lizard man going? Why don't I just beat him up? Oh shit. <laughs> what do you mean I can't see him? He's right there! I feel like he did notice me though. Also, there was a place that I passed up. Uh, it was on Sunday. And <laughs> I saw a giant sign that said, Gamers eat pizza here for free. And I told the girl that I'm dating, I'm like, Stop the car right now. I gotta tell them. <laughs> Sadly, it's a. It's, it's a slot machine place, so that's what the kind of gamer they meant. But could you met just uh listen? I'm a gamer, alright. Let me let me show you my streams. Finally a reward for playing games. Pizza. Oh, I could go do some Murray stuff. Man, I gotta go walk all the way back to the safe house. How have I not found the rest of the bottles, though? She's never tried the pizza from there, either, so... Who knows? Maybe it could be really bad. It could be like a gamer's eat here because we're gonna poison you. Which is fair. I try to poison me, too. Somewhere. Yeah. I guess I can do the. Oh, oh. I just realized that the rack is there. Oh, there's one. So I'm gonna get this guy real quick. 
Yeah, so it's these here, these little question mark paper note bottle things. That's what I need. So if you see those, let me know. Then we can, uh, we can get the trophy together as a family. shit to break in this game too. But yeah, so Sly Cooper, it's like a stealth platformer game. Came out... The first one came out, I think, like 2002? And yeah, it was a game that I played as a kid. And I felt like I needed to go back and and finish it because most of the time I feel like most of the games that people watch me play are either horror games or platformers so I figured why not go back to one that I never properly finished oh my god there's there's a lot happening I feel like this one has already been a little more focused on combat because the first game you would die in one hit which was Absolutely terrible. I hated that. But, yeah. This one seems a little more lenient. It's a little more open as well. The first game's levels were a little more straight line. But yeah, if you want to watch that one, uh, I did play through that game as well. And I'll, eventually, I'll have all the games in the collection for the folder there. The oh, there it is. I feel like there would be one up here, but I don't think you can get up here. Anything? Yeah, let's go to let's go to Dimitri's office first. Oh, it's right here. Listen in on his conversations. Yes, I thought things might go more smoothly with an ear on the inside. Just be careful with the fine art. Take any damage and the painting's ruined. Oh, shit. We have to actually, uh, be stealthy. Which, uh,. Stealthy to get up there. And that's where the other bottles are. Oh. Well, there's another one. If you get all the bottles, you get a secret. Probably. You kind of got something when you got all the pages in the last game. I don't see why I wouldn't be in this one too. Hmm. I feel like it would be down there. I don't see it. <laughs> I didn't know that people still did the bird is the word thing. I was on Family Guy. It was probably the most annoying thing you could do in, I think it was high school. So many dickheads in high school. We gotta be mature, we're in high school. It's like, who gives a shit? Doesn't matter. Everybody there was such a turd. Alright, where am I supposed to go? That's the wrong button. That's oh, also the wrong button. You 
got to enter the nightclub via the balcony. Yes, it's not. Hmm. I guess I went the, the wrong way. It's in Fort. Oh. Oh, yeah. Yeah, because Peter Griffin got added to Fortnite. Like, what else could you even add to that game at this point? I feel like everything's in it. <laughs> it's okay. kind of soup are you having? I'm honestly surprised that there is uh, that there isn't a Minecraft Steve skin in uh, in Fortnite. Isn't Roblox just actually I I don't even know what Roblox is anymore. The, s the soup is dry? What kind of soup is dry? That sounds like a bad soup. You sure it's soup? Did you forget to add the broth to the soup? this how you get I don't know where to go oh okay now I can go into soup has <laughs> got the boneless Yeah, no, that's soup. Yeah, just a big old pile of bones. The crunchier it is, the more soupy it is. Shout out to I'm a man. I'm a man is a cool person. Who the fuck is... I never was one for the direct approach. I mean, to some, you know... To some animals, I guess people are soup. Alright, I gotta make sure I don't get hit or else I'll hurt my painting. You'd think there'd be a better route for us to take on this, but... Are we fighting the janitorial staff? I guess the person that says I'm a man, I guess they could be pulling a fast one on you, you're right. There's so many janitors here, my god. I thought I'd have to I'm gonna go right here. Where's the This seems like a really ass backwards way to get into somewhere. No. <laughs> no. His name is Sly Cooper. He is the Thievius Raccoonus. Uh oh. I 
could play the Guardians of the Galaxy game, though. Apparently it's really good, I just... I'm so burnt out on... on Marvel stuff. I just couldn't be bothered to, to play it. I'd be down for that. I don't know if Sucker Punch is ever going to do another Sly Cooper thing, though. I think they're busy with Ghost of Tsushima 2? I think that's what they're working on. But I think they've kind of got the same way as, uh, as Naughty Dog, where they're like, I don't want to make cartoony games anymore. I'd rather play. I'd rather make serious games. I tried playing Ghost of Tsushima and I just thought it was kind of boring. But I think I might have just been playing it when I didn't want to play that kind of game. Oh. Wait, was that... Was that seriously it? Did it. So yeah, uh, if you notice any kind of lag or anything happening in the stream for the game, it's because uh, I'm streaming it through the PS5 streaming thing and it's kind of not the best. Yeah, it should be on for a while, so yeah, you should be good. I just appreciate anyone who comes around, so... What, uh... Else? Is there anything else in here? I, I will have to come... If I find that other bottle, I'll definitely have to come back and open that vault. Because there could be powers and stuff that I could use. It could be. It's needle in a haystack now. Avoid getting spotted by the flashlight guards. And if you get caught, you can run away by holding down the R1 button. Is that it? What is that? That can't be it. Ah, shit. I just feel like I'm really close to the microphone, like just breathing into it. If you can get this piece of fine art back to the safe house in one piece, we can sell it on the net for a ton of coins. Give us to... What does that say? LGT... Do you... Do you know me? Okay. Sure. I was afraid that was going to be like a Oligma situation. I wanted to read it to myself first and then I was like, wait, no, I don't know what that could be. Where is the... No, I did not watch the Resident Evil Welcome to Raccoon City. I heard it was really bad, so I just didn't bother with it, but I don't know, maybe eventually I will. I don't see why not. I think I might watch it for I think I might watch it for the podcast though. We might do like a video game month. Because unfortunately there's a lot of really shitty horror movie, video game movies. Have you guys ever seen the House of the, of the Dead movie? 
I owned that on DVD because I was bad with my money. I still am, but I was then too. One of the worst movies I have ever seen in my life. Ooh, the gold painting. Let's grab the fists of flame. What's up with his chin here? Yeah. <laughs> I think it's worth watching just because it's so terrible, but just expect it to be one of the worst movies you'll ever see in your entire life. It's... God, it is so bad. It's, it's actually kind of dumbfounding. In a way, it's a little inspiring, though. Because you can watch it and go, I think I could make a movie. Doesn't have to be good. But you could at least make it. I think the thing was over here. Man, Murray sure does move really fucking slow. But you gotta just punch. That'll work. another really bad one like uh alone in the dark has a movie i haven't watched that one but it looks horrible so i'm sure that i will eventually have to watch it there's so many shitty shitty video game movies out there the original resident evil movies oh my god they were so bad it's just embarrassing how terrible those movies were. I think I made it to the second one of those and went, I'm done. Just done. I saw Catwoman in theaters. That movie was... Oh my god. And there was a game for it too. If you thought the movie was bad, the game is horrendous. I just don't know how you can mess up a movie with Halle Berry and leather and make it one not sexy and two make it one of the worst things anyone's ever seen in their life. I'm just gonna punch all this shit. What am I supposed to do with the... Oh, whoops. I don't know why I thought that was the solution. It's... That's the solution. Break it. Pick up this chair. The box. Just anything. Just break it, please. Enemies that are knocked out can be picked up with your stomp moves. Throw something at that guard. Then jump up there and pick them up with the circle button. Oops. There we go. Where'd he go? Oops. Uh -oh. Beat the shit out of him, Murray. God, everything's full of coins. No, I don't think preferring to play as the the main title character is a bad thing. I think if the main if the characters are cool, I think it'll work that you can switch to other characters. If they suck, then it's the worst experience ever. I mean, does anybody really like playing as any of the Sonic uh, sidekicks? Playing as Coco and 
Uh, the, the crash games isn't that bad either. But yeah, playing as like Hunter and stuff, like, fuck that. Drown him. Yeah, pick up a rat and throw him in the... Throw him in. How many rats do I gotta throw into this thing? Okay. I hate money bags too, but he just takes all my stuff. Okay, fellas, I've constructed a plan to get at the clockwork tail feathers, but we'll need to pull off a few more jobs to set things up for the heist. First, Sly will have to pick a few pockets in the theater so that we'll have access to the spotlight control center. Ooh. Once that's accomplished, we'll be able to turn off all the security around the printing press. We'll need your muscle, Murray, to take out all the exterior alarm horns. We don't want anything to alert the guards while we pull off the big job. And finally, we'll need to get into the discotheque to drop this mirror ball. Trust me, it's all part of the plan. Hell yeah. It's all part of the plan, baby. Okay, there's no trigger bomb things I can get yet. Oh, there it is. Oh, there's a different one. It's actually closer by. Where is that last bottle? It's gotta be here somewhere. Hold it, Koopa. Constable Mila. Another policewoman hot on my Another tail. weird furry Ladies, awakening for think? another so person. That gang slip was a clue. Why are you helping me out? I'm not as black and white as Carmelita. I know what I'm Why are there so many furries? Well, why do they make them all like this? So what? It's an interesting question to ask yourself. Something like that. But if I'm going to trust you in this case, I need to know that you can keep up. Literally. Literally. Don't fall behind. Why? Pull down the arm. Oh, I can run. Well, I. She doesn't seem that fast. I'm, I'm... <laughs> oh, I wasn't supposed to hit her. <laughs> I thought it was like, I gotta, I gotta catch up to her to hit her. He'll need it, and I'm I'm running past her. She's so slow. Oh god. It's, it's easily the worst kind of missions. I hate them as much as I hate, like, uh, any racing minigame stuff, too. Any instant fail missions are just the absolute pits. Why are we doing this? Yeah, 
But yeah, yeah, no, I... I'll have to see how the ending is for Spy or Sly 4, because I don't... I, I don't think it's going to be that bad, but maybe it will be. I'm not entirely sure. Well done, Sly. We I did it! Glad you approved. Now, legally, I can't enter Dimitri's nightclub without a warrant. But I happen to have obtained the key to his back door, which a person like yourself can use however he pleases. Oh, we are absolutely going to work well together. I can steal a couple more things. At least I can run now, though. I didn't know I could run. That is definitely a welcome addition to the game. Cool. I really hope I can find that last stupid hint bottle. Go back and grab it. Oh, it's gone now. Yeah, they changed one of the voice actor people too. I can't remember what the character's name is though, but it's the, the female fox girl. That's the word I was looking for. Alright, sell some stuff. Yeah, chalice. Get the trigger bombs. Alright, let's do a Bentley level. Yeah, I don't mind changing the characters in this game as long as they're not horrible to use. Oh yeah, his thing's over there. Run, Bentley, run! Is that how he seriously runs? I went the wrong way. How do I feel about shrimp? I love shrimp so much, actually. <laughs> If there is anywhere that has all-you-can-eat crab or all-you-can-eat shrimp, I will be in that venue forever. <laughs> I will not leave. Yeah, shrimp is just so delicious. Any seafood, honestly. Like, I love fish, too. I've been to some hibachi grill stuff and it's pretty fun. Mushroom would be fine, but yeah, I'm not supposed to eat too many mushrooms. AYC buffet with... Oh, yeah, yeah. Press the triangle button to drop a bomb and then get out of the way before it explodes. Yeah, I went to All You Can Eat sushi with a friend of mine and... I was like, I am not gonna just get a million things, though. Oops. Like, it looks like I could use the crossbow thing that he has, but... 
Okay. Okay, so I can't. Alright, fucking kill him now. I don't drink soda anymore, unfortunately. I used to drink soda a lot, and then I think... God, I don't know, like, 13 years ago I stopped drinking it. I just... It made me feel like shit, so I just stopped drinking it. I stopped drinking pretty much anything with caffeine in it, though. Did you sharpen your fridge? If not, here's your reminder so you don't have to. What? No, I don't like tea either. I don't know what it is about tea. I just think it's really nasty. I like juice, though. Like, I'll drink, like, orange juice or, uh... Lemonade. I've been drinking these, like, ghost drinks, but not the energy drink ones. They make, like, a hydration drink one, too. Kind of like Gatorade. Those are pretty good. I also drink Gatorade. Subs <laughs> Suspicious con a substance. I don't, I don't partake in that stuff. What am I doing? He has bombs. <laughs> Sly is definitely a PlayStation icon. Only oh, substance makes things cheap. Men substances? <laughs> oh, baby. No, I don't drink either. But like I said, I don't I don't judge anyone for drinking or anything like that. I at the end of the day, I, I just don't care. I think it's when people are annoying about it, then I'm like, dude, I don't want to I don't want to bother. And put a bomb on him, let him die. How many people do we murder in this game? Ah, shit. How did I fuck that up? Schlub? Oh, no. I do not partake in men's substance either. Nothing. God. <laughs> Nothing against that. It's, what the fuck? I did. Um, I was thinking about, for some reason, I thought it'd be funny to, to buy um, edible lubricant. But I feel like it would taste disgusting or it would just be like jelly. But just... If a friend of mine comes over, I just nonchalantly just get a peanut butter and then just squeeze a huge tube of it on there. And they're like, what the fuck? I think something's wrong with me, though. Will that blow up? Yeah. Play-Doh is edible, but that doesn't mean you should eat it. <laughs> you can make your own Play-Doh, too. I don't remember how to do it, but as a poor kid growing up, uh, we had to make do. Was that not something I need to do? Can I climb this? I'm not exactly sure what I was supposed to put the bomb on. 
put it here and I thought that was supposed to be like back in the air. Oh, yeah. Clean out a shampoo bottle from Gatorade or something. Just chug it in front of the <laughs> No, you gotta clean. Well, the thing is, though, is that you should just get a shampoo bottle that didn't already have shampoo in it. Like, find something that can look like a shampoo bottle because getting all the shampoo out, like really getting it out, huge pain in the ass. Lobster is incredible. I wish I could afford to eat it. <laughs> I told my friend that I want to go to to Maine so that I could go to just eat a bunch of lobster. I just want to go somewhere, eat a lot of really good food for a really low price. That's all I want. Why is there a dude named Great? Oh god. Florida does have lobster. Yeah. I've never been to Florida. I feel like I should go. And then again, I don't know. Would I vibe with Florida? Arkin, were you were you eating shampoo? Ah, oh, okay. That's where I'm supposed to go. Yeah, what does it smell like fruit if it doesn't taste like fruit? That's how, like, I use a facial cleanser and it smells like orange juice. I'm like, it smells delicious. I want to eat this. Yeah, sushi is incredible. I wish I could eat more of that, too. That's not a shame. <laughs> Do I look like the kind of guy that eats poo? No. You'd think that they would notice that there's a turtle guy that's just breaking shit, but I guess they just don't care. I think it's like a pretty flexible dish there. You guys can indulge all you want in that. Do not. <laughs> Too late. I already did. I did it. I dropped the disco ball. Wow, Bentley. We thought that all the way back here at the safe house. No, you didn't. Oh, wait, yeah, they have cameras and stuff. I don't know what I'm talking about. Disco is never truly done. Dude, I'm never finding that last bottle. It is somewhere. I just don't know where. Where the hell is it? talking about dad doesn't want me to watch horror and mom's new boyfriend didn't want me to watch skylanders i guess i can't be mama's why can't you watch <laughs> why can't you watch skylanders what how do you feel about hot dogs um I mean, I, I don't know. It's hard for me to eat 
a lot of hot dogs because that was once again something I ate a lot as a kid. Same with like fish sticks. I have to say it because I feel like I accidentally say fish sticks all the time, but yeah, I can't eat. I cannot eat that shit anymore, but hot dogs, it's just like every once in a while though, it's not, it's not too bad. There's some really good hot dog places, well, in Chicago, obviously, and then there's one in St. Louis, too. But yeah, getting a really good hot dog, oh, delish. I mean, even with, with phones, I mean, you can kind of watch whatever you want, as long as you got Bluetooth headphones, too. Nobody has to bother you. <laughs> Gotta hit it raw, man. Don't actually hit it raw. That's the worst thing you could ever do in your life. Don't worry, Aiden. Your life will get better. Hopefully. Once you get to a certain age, you kind of just... Unfortunately, have to make your own decisions on things. And I feel like even as an adult, I'm like, I still don't know what the hell I'm doing. Where is this last bottle? Oh my god. Trying to scope it out, but man, it is just... Who knows? Let's go do this thing now. Hey -ah. The Costco hot dog meal deal is a, a banger, though. Dollar fifty for I think you get yeah, a hot dog and a drink, but dude, a dollar fifty. Let's go. I know that Sam's Club tried to do something similar, like they had a hot dog thing, and dude, it just their hot dogs are disgusting. Beat some ass. Let's go. Pick him up. Oh. Okay, where is... Yeah, like, but that's the thing, though. It People go in there for that deal, but if you go into Costco, you're going to buy more things. So really, it's beneficial to Costco to lose a little bit money on the damn hot dogs. No one wants you dead, Aiden. You have to be here to watch the stream. And also, you have a lot... Of life ahead of you. Oh, it's all the way over there. Yes, sir. Your purpose is to watch my live streams. What an existence to have. There's just a mold 
guy up here. Do not do what any anything what low tier god does. That guy is very toxic. Oops. Throw a newspaper at that. Stance. Always be on high alert. I mean, I mean, in the grand scheme of things, our lives don't really mean anything, but I think at the other side of it is we kind of just make it what it is. I think you should just surround yourself with people that you like and that they like you too and just try to make the most of things. Or just sit around and just chat with random people. That works too, you know? make a big impact on random things. The main thing is if you know if you know how to convince people to do things you can make more things happen. Because you can have the ideas but it's the having the words to say to get people to do the thing that's really how you can really progress in your own life like say for example work conditions suck at your job you can say that the things suck all day long no one will care but you have to make the problem everyone's problem you have to present it like it's at their front door and they have to do something about it then that's how you can have like a worker strike or something like that. You gotta just make it to where it's gonna benefit them as well. Uh, how do I feel about the live action Garfield movie? The one that Bill Murray was in? I watched. <laughs> I saw that one in theaters. It is a. not really good movie. It's not the worst movie you could ever see, but man, man, it's pretty bad. Bill Murray joined it because he thought it was a Coen brother movie and it wasn't, it was, uh, God, I can't remember. He, he got the name wrong basically though. I'm like, man, imagine that. You think you're going to do this really awesome movie and then, whoops, Garfield. Else. Maybe we are helping the aliens. My brother wanted to make a story about aliens. Uh, he made this little comic strip thing as a kid called Carl the Stick. It was really bad, but uh, I mean, you know, he liked making it. But he was like, I'm going to make a story and it's about aliens coming to Earth and they take your poop and to, <laughs> to fuel their planet or something. And I'm like, I don't, he just said it so just out of the blue while we were in the car. And I'm like, <laughs> you were really thinking about this, weren't you? 
Hippo, yeah, he dies whenever going in water. Yeah, yeah I think it's just because they didn't put anywhere to get out of the water. I think that's why it kills you automatically. Okay, let's go switch to Sly now. I was thinking they kidnap the humans and suck all the poop out of them. I mean, at the end of the day, aren't we all just fertilizer? Our remains will be used to fertilize the grounds of tomorrow until until we all just die in a big fireball which might happen in like 20 years so we might not even get a like a a slow death or anything like that we'll just die just in a big old apocalyptic fire yay Play the little party thing. Yeah, there you go. Are we just gonna have existential dread in this uh, in this stream? He's voicing Garfield. Yeah, I told Dylan that I want to go see the Garfield movie with him. So I hope that he actually uh, he visits so he can go see it. I'm sure he's going to love it, so... I've seen worse movies, though. Like, what could be worse than a Garfield movie? I never saw the second Garfield movie, The Tale of Two Kitties. I just thought that looked pretty bad. I don't even know why I saw the first one, to be honest. I just... I guess I just had nothing else better to do. Where is this last bottle? Those movies are garbage. I did see that live action Cat in the Hat movie. I own that on DVD as well. And we watched it all the time because it was just so baffling, bafflingly bad. What the hell were they thinking with that? That movie made it to where they couldn't just make Dr. Seuss movies anymore. Like, you, you're not allowed to make any more of these. It's like spitting on his grave. So Dr. Seuss apparently wasn't that great of a person, so... Uh, let's see... Honestly, that's like an achievement in its own. I made a movie so bad it made people not allowed to make any more movies. Yeah, he did. He wasn't exactly someone with uh, morals.
Sorry, Bentley, but those fans are spitting. I feel like Disney will be the ones to to implement AI the most in their movies. A lot of their movies lately just seem like they're just randomly generated. Fuck smoking? Is that what it is? Gotta pickpocket the guard. Oh, there he is. I did it! <laughs> Got him. Yeah, I feel like most of the good Disney movies are Pixar movies. Those are the only ones that I feel like I go out of the way of watching. The other ones, I'm like, I don't really want to watch them. Like that Raya and the Last Dragon movie, I just didn't care. Like, I'm not watching this. I feel like, though, I will probably eventually watch it by accident. keys to shut down the fans. Okay. I really did like Gravity Falls though. That was that was really good. I gotta hide under the table. Never mind, he turned around. Oh god damn it. <laughs> Unfreeze Walt, let us hear what he has to say. Actually, I don't want to hear what Walt Disney has to say. He, uh. He was not a. He was not a good dude. What the fuck? What the fuck? What is happening? I didn't want him to go under the table. Oh my god. Got it. What did he do? He... Very infamously hates Jews. Very anti-Semitic guy. Oh god, I cannot see. <laughs> like I said, really infamously did not like Jewish people. Semitic guy. Yes, that is exactly where those jokes came from. Yeah. It's not even a joke. It was just... The guy just really hated Jewish people. They try to, like, wash over that whole fact they try to make it seem like oh man Walt Disney must have been a really great guy no no he was not yeah we talked about Zootopia before I like that movie oh god he's gonna kill me maybe I can just hide under the table
keep stealing money. Yeah, the anti-Semitic stuff, though. I mean, that's... Yeah, the making a comeback thing. I really hope it, it doesn't make a comeback because it's... It's the last thing that we fucking need. But yeah, it's all conspiracy people shit. So much misinformation out there that people are like, Well, this fits with what I thought anyway, so I'm gonna follow it. It's like, that's a terrible thing to do. But I also think that a lot of media stuff will concentrate a lot on the the bad going on in the world more. And I'll feel like it'll make you think that things are a lot more doomed than they are. And I, I really hope that things are gonna get worse. My favorite Shrek character? Uh, I think my favorite part about Shrek is how much Shrek doesn't want to be there. You could just tell he's like, I just don't want to go on this adventure, man. Just Let's just get this shit and get out of here. Yeah, yeah, like it's Zootopia though, that's a good movie. Misinformation. Uh, misinformation, my favorite kind of information. No, it is not. <laughs> I think that everyone should take a media literacy class though. I think just with so much misinformation and stuff. You would think it'd be common knowledge, but there is just so much stuff that people fall for. You're like, this is baffling. <laughs> Well, it's got the spotlight on me. I fear watching that Puss in Boots movie, though. Yeah, I would say that he's definitely one of my favorite characters now, too. That was a really good movie. Just came out of nowhere, too. It's like, they're gonna make a sequel to Puss in Boots? And who cared about the first one? And then after watching the second one, it's like, oh my god. Why is this so good? Oh boy. Oh, I didn't know he had a key on him. This is stupid. <laughs> I hate these instant fail missions. Okay, let's go find... There he is. Is he gonna turn around? Get the key! God, there's some Karens out there, man, I tell you. They are just the absolute worst people in society. But I would say that just there's just a lot of like entitled boomer people that are just horrible to sit there and talk to. God. They will just make sure they take everything from you. Remember one guy just not reading the fine print on something and just being like, "Well, I think I should deserve this because I'm, I'm a veteran and this and that." And I'm like, "Dude, I don't make any of the rules here. Do you really think I care?" Dude was such a dickhead. Now I don't mean anything against like veterans or anything like that. I think that this country does a terrible job of helping anybody that actually needs help. You know, bootstraps, whatever the fuck. I think they forget that they get a lot of help from random things, but... Yeah. Yeah, I think that the country could do a lot better with helping anybody with disability. 
understanding mental illnesses and stuff too. Uh, fixing the camera controls in this fucking game. But yeah, no, just like understanding what any mental illness is. And just I'm like, oh, depression is just being sad. It's like, nope, it's having the ability not to be able to control your sadness. I'm sure there are videos on their channel, but just... Yeah, no, that shit's awful. Alright, how do I get up there? Oh, I gotta f crawl on the lights. Oh, there it is. I think that's a good thing, though, of not or having so many iconic video game characters. Because I mean, I feel like that that just shows there's so much out there. Got the last key. Nice work, Sly. Now head for the control panel to slow down the fan. We got the keys to the only fans. <laughs> Aiden, isn't Arcan like a friend of yours? Shouldn't ban your friends. <laughs> Only I have the power to ban. Oh, there was something I wanted to pop into the chat real quick, because I just found the folder for it. Let me see here. I have this folder full of random Steam keys. I don't know what they are, but you guys can have one of them. Someone will get this. I don't know who will. I don't even know what it is, but I'm just going to throw it in here. Good luck <laughs> to whoever gets it. No, you have to put that into Steam and then that no, it's not a it's not a link. You just activate the product on Steam and then you'll be able to use the game. I forgot that I, I had that stuff. It's your mom. Got him. You don't use Steam? Okay, whoever uses Steam, do you want to... <laughs> I've never... <sighs> I've never seen people not want a game. I don't even know what it is. If it's something really bad, I apologize, but it's it's yours, whoever wants it. I got them like a long time ago. <laughs> Wait, what am I supposed to do? It's not going to tell you what the game... It's all... <laughs> they're randomly generated keys. Oh, wait. I was able to do the fans. That's what it was. Yes, it is. It is very difficult to make a game. My brother made one, and he would definitely tell you that it's a huge pain. Uh. Okay, 
Okay, fellas, the dominoes are all in place. Oh, here we go, baby. First, Mari will help me break into the old water tower. Did anyone figure out how to redeem the steam key for themselves? It's only one key, so. Lichtum <laughs> Battle Mage. I'm so sorry. <laughs> bon Appetit. Congratulations, random guy. You won the Lichtum Battle Mage key. Yeah, I just have a bunch of random Steam keys and stuff. I just never knew what to do with them. Bone Apple Tea. I want to make sure I get everybody's name. There was someone else in here too, wasn't there? Who may not? Oh. Okay. Well. <laughs> uh. I remember seeing this video where it was like someone made that bone apple tea thing and then they were like get it because it's wrong and they were like uh-huh yep <laughs> what a horrible day to be on uh, and of course you know the hourly reminder if you are watching the stream and you haven't haven't subscribed and you're enjoying yourself Feel free to subscribe and you can join in live if you're watching this after the fact, but yeah. Of the teeth brush. <sighs> Wait, what am I supposed to do? nothing for me to sell uh, but at least it pays off in some game become world classics like this one yeah that is true yeah yeah with the, the video games being made uh, my brother did like a sale on his game well he basically gave the game away for free but he barely got any views before but f from doing that sale he got like 4,000 people to look at his game and I'm like dude that's still pretty incredible. Okay, where am I supposed to go? Yeah, the game is called, uh, Curio? He just dropped, like, most of the, the title of that game, and now it's just... I think it's Legend of Curio or something, but yeah, like I, I made the music for the game. It's not good music, but <laughs> I tried my best. I'm so confused. What am I supposed to be doing? Yeah, I mean, it, putting putting any time and effort into anything just and it actually ends up working out feels amazing. 
I mean, shit, just having anybody come into the streams at all feels amazing. It's like, oh my god, there's actually someone here? You have to be cool in order to walk like Sly. I thought I was supposed to... Okay, it's over here. Oh, I was supposed to play as Bentley. Okay. Whoops. You probably said that I missed it. Oh my god. I wish that my room was a little bit bigger. I can't really like stretch my legs out or anything. And I get the hiccups. Fuck. Come on, chum. Let's get to that water tower. Hold on one second, I am going to go to the bathroom real quick. I'll be right back. Oh. Let's see here. I'm his only fan. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> uh. I liked Lilo and Stitch. I can't remember the last time I watched it, but I remember liking it. I think it was one that I we ended up watching a lot in like middle school. I did a I went to a Disney trivia night thing and let me tell you I didn't know a goddamn thing. Nothing. Not a zilch. They're like, what's the guy in Strange Journey? And I'm like, what the fuck movie is that? Jump into my arms. I'll toss you up there. Don't oh, jump into the circle button. Duh. Ali you? What? Gotta 
turn them around. go in <laughs> I can eat him in okay there he goes everyone saw where it went upside down for a second right I didn't just imagine that See if we'll solve the puzzle here. All this running water, remember, guys, stay hydrated. Oh, wait, there's one over here. Or food in your walls it's like all right. They're already sending out the repair guy to fix it up. <laughs> I made some horrible mac and cheese. You can have that. I can throw that in the wall. I tried putting spices in to make it better, and I think I made it worse. Usually it's supposed to be that it just it gets better and then nope. Yeah, I fart in my walls a lot. Slot, the water pressure to the fountain should be disabled. It's off all right. They're already sending out the repair guy to fix it up. Take pocket the keys to his repair truck without being seen. Yeah, I have a tube in my wall and I just fart in the tube. I don't know why I didn't think of putting ranch in the mac and cheese. Hmm. I'm gonna have to do that. I put salt in it because it just tasted like nothing. And then I put too much salt in it, so now it just tastes like salt. It is a. Okay, it's my life. Wait, where am I supposed to go? Dude, which I need the heat, man. It is. It is ice cold in my room. Like, I have heat, but it doesn't really. Like, I can't have it on because it's too expensive. Dude, where is that other bottle? I, I cannot. That's gonna drive me insane. If it was like a bunch of them that I was missing, maybe whatever, but it's it's one. One that I'm missing. Do I watch any TV shows? <laughs> You're in my floor, so oh god. <laughs> You're like a little rat. 
Um, TV shows wise, I finished up Ted Lasso. That was the last show that I was really into. Uh, there are some other ones I want to check out though. I want to watch Yellow Jackets. I heard that was pretty good. And what else was there? I don't know. I, f I feel like I'm not uh, caught up on anything. Or in, like what is out and what's good to watch. It's all you. <laughs> Let's head out for the repair truck. Hey, there was one time I heard a random knocking. So please, if that was you. Wait, what am I supposed to? This keeps happening. I'm like... What am I doing? This is definitely a different... Uh... Uh-oh. Oh god. Get out of there, Bentley. We gotta kill him. No evidence can be left behind. Mmm, <laughs> delicious. I love wall meat. They're like, uh, okay, Sly isn't, I mean, like, Sly is, I guess, the leader, but it's, they're more of a trio of, like, where one can't do it, the other person can do it. So, Sly is, like, the speed, and Bentley is the brains, and then Murray is the brawn. sign now. <laughs> I mean, wouldn't you want to trust a random guy? If you guys see this last bottle, please tell me. Bolt the collectible guide, but I feel like that kind of just makes it uh, kind of takes the fun out of it. Uh, what am I gonna stream next? It all depends. I'm in position. Yeah, it really depends on what I can get soon, but if I can get the portal. Oh shit. There we go. Hooks on. Pull away. Sly, the guards are on to us. Uh -oh. Protect the truck. Oh god. Oh god. Get away from the truck. Fucking assholes. Come on. <laughs> I 
it. No, my my bed is like it's on a it's on a bed frame. I didn't grow up on these games. Yeah, so like I was trying to show on the thing here real quick. The next game I plan on streaming is this one right here. This one right here, if it'll show up on for yeah. Skylander Swap Force. That is the one. So. <sighs> that is the... <laughs> yeah, Skylander Swap Force. The problem is, is that the portal I have doesn't work with it, so I have to get a different portal. But I should have one soon. The original trilogy? That could be fun. I don't know if I have it in me to play any more Spyro games, though. Still have to be the crash games too. I was thinking that uh there was there was something else that I wanted to play. I just didn't know if you guys would be into it. I wanted to play uh Lollipop Chainsaw, but I didn't know if you guys would be into it. Like, it's kind of horror-esque, but it's like a hack-and-slash horror game. It's a little weird. It's really weird. They're doing a remake of it, though. Ta-da! Behold the majesty of gravity and inertia! That was real subtle, Bentley. Okay, you jump in, grab the clockwork tail feathers, and we're out of here! Down. Look, bro, I think you are a tough cowboy. A man with taste, style, vision, a connoisseur of finer things. Like me. Look, I'm sure that two cats in a bag like us can work something out. Yeah? We smooth. Look, smooth the money. You like the money. You can take all you want. I can't Aiden does not have the power to ban the anyone. The do not worry. To be stopped. Clock Only I do. Again see the light of day. Just hand over the tail feathers and we can... What is this with clocks, bro? Have you no vision? Are you hearing what I mean to you? You think you have juice? Don't show me a little mind when talking about such big things. You think you can swing the bat? Show your bling and let me shine you. I have no <laughs> idea what you're saying. And your suit sucks. <laughs> the fuck is he talking about? <laughs> Alright, let's see how this boss battle goes. Oh my god. Is that not what it's supposed to be? Oh god, it wasn't. Alright, triangle's the way to go. Uh -oh. Okay, I just gotta upper, uppercut him a lot. Uh oh, shit. Okay, here we go. Oh god. Yeah, shit, he killed me. 
What's a slug? <laughs> Like if I had the opportunity to play these games, I'd do it. You should. If you have a PS5, you should definitely play it. Or even if you have like a... God damn it. Okay, I didn't think you'd be able to hit me there, but... What the fuck are you guys talking about? <laughs> Or some kind of remake. This is a remaster. This is uh, the PS3 version of the PS2 games. Yeah, I do. I agree. He does deserve a comeback. Cream between. Oh, God. Let me have a birds and the bees talk with them. Oh god, he I can't see anything. Oh come on, I thought I was blocking. Oh god. There we go. Everyone here is a degenerate. This is kind of the the style. Tail feathers were ours, and Dimitri's counterfeiting operation was ruined. Due to the untimely arrival of Carmelita, my escape got a little tricky. Angry at having just missed me, she took it out on Dimitri. Shutting down the nightclub and throwing the frustrated forger behind bars. The gang and I headed out of town for a week in Monaco. I figured the team had earned themselves a well-deserved break. Uh, I could see a remake going really well for Sly Cooper. I'd be down for that. Another clockwork part had surfaced in India, so the boys and I loaded up the van and zeroed in on our next target. A mysterious spice lord known as Rajan. A self-made man who grew up poor on the streets of Calcutta, he started his life a crime selling illegal spices in the black market, eventually growing his small outfit to a sizable operation and earning himself a seat in the prestigious Claw Gang. He since crowned himself Lord of the Hills 
And while he goes to great lengths to convince others of his royalty, it's mostly to convince himself. True to form, he's holding a lavish ball in his newly purchased Ancestral Palace. The reason? To show off his latest acquisition, the Clockwork Wings. The symbol of my enemy. If you saw the wings silhouetted against the night sky, it was already too late for you. Especially if your name was Cooper. Rajan believes displaying the wings will bring him prestige. And maybe they will. But they're also bringing me. No one's allowed to drink blood in the stream. No blood drinking tonight. <laughs> I think I have to buy all the stuff. Please stop existing. No, we do not tell people that. tab where am I <laughs> uh, no that's not what I that's not what I want there we go That was weird. I hit the wrong button. <laughs> no, no gooning. You are not allowed to goon in the stream. It just isn't right. How many YouTube accounts do you have? There is no banning here. Unless you do something really fucking stupid in here. Uh oh. Where is the safe house? Did it. Aiden only gets revived if I hit a hundred subs. It's the only way. jump and hit the circle button to perform a ninja spire landing. That's correct. Now let's see it in action. <laughs> I 
say his name three times in the dark, and then your power goes out, and then you die. Oh shit. Dudes. Yeah, I'm so glad you don't die in one hit anymore in this fucking game. And having that many YouTube accounts. You guys have a lot of free time. Onion tender sounds fucking del dis despicable. I ugh. Yeah, I saw that. I saw that that was in theaters. It, it looks really bad. I didn't watch the first one. I don't... I don't know. Some people were like, It has a high Rotten tomato score. I can't believe it. And it's like, I, I don't really care about Rotten tomato scores. You can only know if movie's good or bad as if you see it. So I've seen some movies where it's like, oh, it's only got like a 20%, but I really liked it. And then there's times where I got like a 90%. I'm like, this is the worst movie I've ever seen in my life. No, it wasn't me. Talking about for Sky Skylanders. I, I try to be the best cool dude. I don't know what that means, but you know, I, I strive. I don't think it'll matter too much. Honestly, I don't know what the hell's going on in most of the Skylander games. So I think it should be alright. I end up watching a lot of terrible movies because of podcasts. Some of the movies that we pick, oh my god, I wish I could just eject my eyeballs out of my skull. PS3 streaming thing isn't too bad. It, it is. But chugging along. I 
I gotta take this random thing back to the the base so I can actually get money. Now if I could just remember how to get there. Oh god. They definitely improved his move set and stuff too. Like he's a lot more fun to to use. <laughs> yeah, zombie killer. Yeah, you. I think you're the only normal person in my streams. I'm surprised that there's not more weird stuff being asked if I had to be honest uh, I'm concerned about what the most screwed up thing could be Eventually I'll get there, right guys? I didn't think I'd have 83, so yeah, 100 will be pretty crazy. Yeah, they were. Yeah, this was one that I played with my brother a lot. And then, uh. Yeah, like Crash Bandicoot and Spyro and stuff were other ones too that we played. Yeah, we kind of played a little bit of everything, though. And then I would watch my dad play, uh, Resident Evil and Metal Gear Solid and stuff. Um, the, uh, honestly, like, PS1 era stuff, if I am given any PS1 game, I'm ecstatic. I absolutely love PS1 era stuff. I wish I could actually have, like, a full PS1 collection. I'm trying to go for a full PS2 collection, but that's so many games, and I don't think I'm gonna get them. I imagine a heart has a consistency feeling of like if you took a bunch of fruit roll-ups and kind of just smash them together. Not a problem. There seem to be plenty of branches for me to walk on. I'll figure it out. A complete PS5 game collection? I mean, that might be the most realistic one I could get. Man, there's... Then again, yeah, I don't know. You'd have to buy, like... If you want a complete collection of any game system, you have to buy everything when it's clearanced out. But there's some things where it's like, well, does it count if it's like a limited run games? Like, as if that counts, then it's just a huge pain in the ass. Sneak through the door, okay. I'm... Okay. <laughs> Oh man, after seeing the Good Burger thing, uh, man, after... Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> Don't alert the guard, immediately hit something. After I watched that Nickelodeon documentary, the... Um... Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm doing the exact opposite of everything he's telling me. That, that uh, Quiet on Set documentary, after I watched that, I was like, oh my god. Sneak up to the curtain and take a picture. Oh, 
I wish Good Burger was in Fortnite. that you like fog. They look heavy. Getting the wings out of here will be a real challenge. An electronic witch. That could be useful. Where is he? There he is. Yeah, it's kind of like a trait of platformer games, just having annoying shit in there where I'm like, I don't want to do this. Another claw gang member. Our arpeggio specializes in exotic technology. Ooh. with spider girls man come on a lot of degen stuff oh Carmelita's here too god damn she must be undercover with the contessa soggy so socks taste what the fuck is wrong with you again do <laughs> uh Guys, going brain dead. You kind of are the most normal person in the chat, besides uh, zombie. Yeah, I remember some of the Spyro 3 ones being pretty awful to deal with. What is normal, you know? Stealing the clockwork wings in the middle of a crowded ballroom is going to take some serious misdirection. And the squad of undercover cops only makes things more complicated. Although, we might be able to use them to our advantage. But no matter what we do in the ballroom, sooner or later we'll need to deal with Rajan's security chopper. Murray can take it out with some of the local armament, but he won't be able to get inside the palace until Sly lowers the drawbridge for him. Okay. Gadgets. We did that nice thing first. Did Bentley even have a thing up? Never mind. Let's go get Sly. <laughs> I wish I could change the people on the fly. I don't like having to go back and find him whatever hey, there's nothing wrong with being gay I have many friends who are gay and they're cool people
over here? Definitely gotta be some bottles and stuff over here. Shit. I didn't know I learned it. Oh, okay, never mind. Alright, there's another one. I just need to get all the bottles in one of these levels. Oh, and I totally just missed one there. Have you ever cried imagining hugging someone? I cry all the time. Get IRL friends, I should or they should. What does it say? I just hung out. Oh, okay. I think they are friends in real life. Wait, no, wait. Oh, God. This is what I've been training for. Spam. Spam the button. <laughs> Who needs a healthy relationship when you can have really unhealthy relationships and question your own self-worth? Not that I've ever done that. That'd be weird, right? Gotta remember to take this pot back to the the van. Uh oh. Oops, there you go. Healthy relationships are out of style. We're all about gaslighting here. Does that... <laughs> what the fuck? What are you guys spamming? Oh my god. Just a wall of emojis happening here. Why do you support porn exchange? Oh my god. <laughs> wow. I'm speechless, guys. Absolutely speechless. Uh, if anything that I can commend is uh, creativity. If I was a teacher, I'd be sending you guys to the principal's office. Send him to the principal's office and have him expelled immediately. forgetting how to get the hell out of here. Oh no, I'm a little lost. Oh wait, 
No, I'm not. <laughs> oh no, stop, what the fuck? <laughs> oh god. At least getting these coins isn't just aggravating. <laughs> Gotta love a good drone strike, right? sure that every president we've ever had has committed some form of war crimes so yeah you can't be a president without committing some atrocities oh shit oh god God, they're whooping my ass. Stop. Alright, fuck it. I'm leaving. Oh god, they're still throwing shit at me. Thirty-seven years of peace in our over two hundred year history. When did we ever have peace? we've ever had peace. <laughs> okay, I could go to the door, or I could go to the thing over here. I guess I could go to the thing over there. Ah, oh, shit, it's... No, we did not have peace before you guys existed. I died. I feel like there's always something happening somewhere that's like, oh, great. Yeah, I don't know enough to <laughs> be like, yeah, no. To, pal, but the winch is all locked down. You know where I can find the keys? You can't just call her that. Okay, don't kill him. See why I can't just kill them if they have the key on them? I don't know why I have to pickpocket them. Uh oh. Oh god. Leave me be. Why are you guys dying in chat? Oh, that kind of actually helped me out a little bit. 
found another one of the bottles. What are you talking about? There it is. Well, one of them. Get the fuck out of here. I can't. I don't know if I have the ability to help you. You're stuck in the walls, like I can't I can't save you there. Yeah, but for some of the uh like you can't do anything until you've got the item out because if not it'll be like you killed him when he had the keys like just give me the fucking key like it shouldn't matter if I killed him the key's still there uh oh there we go shouldn't have worked but it did Oh my god, I didn't know I could do that. Not really sure where that's going to be useful, but cool. I now know that I can do that. Yeah, eat the wall candy. This guy sucks. <laughs> Bear. Am I going to steal from... God damn it. Ooh, I got a pin. Why? A book club? <laughs> what books do you guys read? What was the last book you finished? I think that could be really interesting. I don't know if I want to read 1984. <laughs> uh. Get behind this guy to pick his pockets. Uh-oh. 
He was killed. He was carrying the key. I'm just trying to figure out how you get this key off the guy that's... I didn't know that I could do a f this. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. So he he does move. Uh -oh. He sees me. That's not good. That's not what I want at all. Oh, he's still throwing shit at me. Stop alerting people, damn. Cool. All right, two more people. And then we should be good to go to go on to the next thing. Really? Did I seriously just land right where the guy is? That takes some serious skills there. Yay! What song is it? Oh god. Ooh, I didn't know this was down here. This actually kind of helped me out. Oh, there's another... Dude, I'm trying to read what you said here. What? He is not a bad person. Who doesn't know what to expect but I think he was a Skylander but I think I can do it on screen for a few minutes to see what he said to be a Skylander but he is a 87 inches in what sit on your hand and stroke oh my god <laughs> no it sounds like a song that my dad would recommend me though I could definitely see that God, these goat dudes. They don't... They don't know that I'm up here.
Oh god. Oh yeah, should we go? Oh, where'd my guy go? He's he just disappeared. Yep. Don't worry about him. Uh, okay. He didn't have anything in his pocket. Just need the last guy. It's a code? I don't get... I don't get it. <laughs> oh, there's another bottle. Stop trying to alert the damn guards. Alright, two more to go. But it'll probably be like last time where I only needed one more and then I had no idea where it was. gonna turn around like that. Where are you guys coming from? Go get out of here. Yay, the other key. Good job, Sly. Now take those stolen keys back to the padlock winch to lower the drawbridge. I feel like... Oh my god. <gasps> A pen! There's got to be one of these damn bottles over here somewhere. I have no idea where it could be. Way to go, sucker punch. You hit him a little too well this time. Okay. Thanks, Sly. Now Murray and I can access the palace grounds. Yay! I did it. Cool. Okay. And a save and quit. Because unfortunately, it is time for me to go. Because <sighs> I'm sleepy. But, uh, let's see. Let me pull up my list of people here. I would like to thank the following people for coming to the stream. I'd like to thank Highbolt Games, True Terror 93, Aiden the Dabber and the Banner, Random Guy, Queso Fan, which was also Aiden, Queso, which was also Aiden, 
Arcane, and of course the Zombie Killer King 97, also known as Epic Zombie Killer. Thank you guys for coming to the stream. Anybody out there who is coming to the stream afterwards, first off, I don't know how you found the stream, but thank you. And come to the stream, subscribe, and then you can join in on the chaos that is the chat, because I don't know what the hell's going on most of the time in it either. And, uh, yeah, subscribe as well, and then who knows, we'll get to 100 subs and do something. I, I don't know. I don't know. We'll, we'll see when we, uh, we'll cross that bridge when we get there. But, yeah, thank you guys so much for coming to the stream. And I'm going to go to bed now. But if you guys want to check out other things that I've streamed, you can find that in the playlists and the tab and all that stuff. There's a lot of videos, so you'll have plenty to watch. All right. Oh, my God. Good night, everybody. Bye-bye.